Hello guys, welcome back to Biology. I am participating today in a challenge and if you would like to know what challenge it is, stay tuned. Welcome to Biology. Stay tuned. So guys, what challenge am I participating in this time? This is the Purge Decluttering Challenge Fall 2020, and it is hosted by no other than Diva Designing on a Dime with Kimberly Davis. Well, what Kimberly wanted us to do in this challenge was find items that you needed to declutter and purge within your home, show your items, discuss a little bit about the items, and then that's it. It's just simple. So guys, what I have been doing lately um, within the last month, I have been selling a lot of things from out of my home because I decided that I wanted to change up a lot of things in my home, which that tour will be coming September the 22nd, the first day of fall. So um, I'm going to show you all how I have decided to do my purge and decluttering. And it is not sponsored, but I did it through Facebook Marketplace. I am going to take you through steps of showing you what are the items that I did purge and declutter and sold to make money back in my pocket. And also, guys, I'm going to show you if you ever want to sell on Facebook Marketplace, how you do it. So guys, okay, let's guys, get It's into what it. Facebook Marketplace actually looks like. And it'll let you know up there. Those are the items that you have sold. And um, here is a listing of all of the items that I have sold. So I'm kind of like moving fast because I do have other people names um, listed on there. So these are the items that I have sold. So not to show my address, I'm going to do it this way. So the first item was a pair of deer string size 13 shoes. These were my son's shoes. And of course you see they were sold. They were $40. And these shoes was practically brand new. So um, I did sell these shoes and um, I list them and they were sold within one day. So guys, this is my first item. That item, guys, in this chair, you have seen it in my living room for the spring and the summer. I am selling this chair. This chair is originally came from Target, and this chair was not a cheap chair. So that's why you see I have it here listed for $145, which, yes, guys, it is on pendant sale. So um, this is the Sterling Archback chair, and this is an item that I did declutter and purge all at the same time. So um, I will meet this person on Saturday, and she will be purchasing this chair for $140. So guys, this is my second item that I did purge. Okay, this is the next items, guys, that I um, I got these chairs here off of Facebook Marketplace for free, and I re-upholstered these chairs, and I decided to sell them for $100 because I did purchase more chairs um, that I like better for my breakfast room. So these are the chairs, and they are restoration hardware-inspired chairs. And I have them listed for $100, and they're on pen and sale to be picked up on tomorrow, which is Wednesday. So, guys, these are another item that I did purge. So, now let's go on to the next item. Okay, guys, the next item is this tall vase. And if you remember, I did get this from the at-home store. Um, at the long consideration, guys, I need to take this off because I decided that I had so many people that wanted to purchase, but I decided I wanted to keep it. So um, I do need to remove this off of um, Marketplace. So this is a listing, but it will be removed because... I have someone now that I am going to be 
using it. So now let's go to the next. So this item, guys, it was also sold. So I do need to mark it as sold. And here you can see once you sell an item, you can go and mark it and say yes. It was sold on Facebook Marketplace, but I cannot show, show you the next. Um, and here it is marked sold. Um, so this item was sold. So that is the way that you do mark your item sold on Facebook Marketplace. So next item. This item was another purge, but what I decided to do, I give these mini mouse shoes to a little girl that was in need. So therefore, I do need to take this listing down because these shoes were given to a little girl. So this is an item, the mini mouse shoes, and they were brand new from the children's place and I had them listed for $10. So this item I do need to remove because I gave them to a well-fitted home. This is my next item, guys. Um, I do have someone that did message me about them. Um, let me see if I can bring it closer. So it's the vase, the bowl, the balls, and this. And also I have the flower planner that is in a different um, photo. So this item is up for sale. And I do have a pending sale on it, which I did not mark it pending yet. So um, I do have this pending. So this is my blue home decor, which I know I will never go back to blue. So I was like, okay, why not? Let's get rid of it. So that was a purge and a declutter all at the same time. So let's go over to the next item. This item, guys, was on my bar, coffee bar for last year. Um, this is my carrot. I sold it for $25. Why? Because now they have the new carrots out. They're much slim line. So I sold this one and I purchased two other carrots. So um, I did sell this one to a very sweet person. So um, yes, this is an item that I decluttered and also purged. So guys, this is another item I did um, when I would do some of my drinks or whatever in filming. I will use this bar cart in the middle of my kitchen floor. So this is a kitchen item, um, Allen. I did sell it and I sold it for $60. So this item was definitely sold. So um, these are two other items, this vase. It went from my front door to my bathroom downstairs to my bathroom upstairs. And I was like, I'm not with the gray any longer. So I did sell this for $25. And I purchased this um, from Burlington some years ago. So um, I did declutter and got rid of that one. And right up under there, I purchased this chair from someone for $5. And I fixed what was wrong with it and discovered that I could not use this chair for my office. So I found out it was a chair for a child. So I did sell it for $10 and boom, it was gone ASAP. So guys, that was another item that I did sell. This is another item, guys. I sold on Facebook Marketplace for $35. This item I did purchase on Facebook Marketplace. It was not in this condition. I did spray it and I decided I did not want it in my office. So I sold it for $100 and made a profit of $40. It'll take you over to this screen and it'll ask you if you're selling an item and it would be selling an item. So it's for Facebook Marketplace. This is where you put all of your photos at. Here's your title, your price, and the category. And the categories do list all of your categories, whether it's parts, craft, art, um, all of the above, cell phones. Um, then they want to know, you put your condition. So really everything that I've always listed was like new. Um, I've never put something fair condition because I wouldn't sell that. I would actually donate it if someone want to do a fixer wrapper. So all of my items are like new when I do list my items. Then you have the description here where you add all the description to the item. If it's something that I'm doing measurements to, I also put my measurements. So guys, after that, you hit next 
and it'll give you the information of here all the what you just put up and it's just that simple it takes it over to review and the review is about three and a half to four minutes five minutes top and it's just that simple and your item has been posted so guys it's just that easy of how to post on facebook so guys it is that easy these are the items that i sold and i'm gonna let you know like right down here exactly how much I made by selling my items on Facebook Marketplace. It helps out tremendously with me doing that because I can then go purchase other items that I do want and um, it's, it's a huge help. So with me selling so many of these items, um, I have redone my downstairs area. So it's just like a super duper thing that I've done because I have changed my house to Restoration Hardware is Duke. So um, my downstairs is that, and I can't wait for me to show you what my home looked like now for the fall. And I've got, again, that video will be uploaded on September the 22nd, the first day of fall. So guys, um, Kimberly, thank you so much for helping me declutter and also making the coins back. So guys, I am out of here. Thank you. Please like, comment, share, thumbs up my video. Don't forget to turn on your notification bell. And if you're new here to the VHive, hi, welcome. I am Vandessa. And if you're oldie but a goodie, hi and welcome back to you. So guys, you know what I always say at the end, I gotta go, but I will be back. And until the next time, guys, bye.